Hello YouTube, we're here, I'm Magnus. It's the first time recording at night, actually, we have to change the lights. But yeah, I'm here with another technology review video to fill your daily dose of bullshit. Let's go. <laughs> okay guys, this is, I don't wanna, uh, it is weird, I mean I, I always play the video a bit but the whole video is about the weird ass bullshit downhill bike which has two wheels in front and it's called the Rungu Electric Jagarnacht and this thing has this huge ass engine which probably weighs 100 kilograms I, I know it's not that much but I mean it's just as, you know I just said that anyway yeah, and those huge ass stuff, those huge wheels and all, the rims, the wheels, the tires, everything, everything huge ass, heavy, this is probably the heaviest downhill bike ever made in the whole world. Well, not, yeah, the world, not the universe. I was thinking, not the whole world, but I don't think this thing even goes into much places of the world many places of the world I always say this stuff wrong and I don't know what's wrong with me probably I have to see a doctor but I'm not going to see a doctor I'm not going to see a therapist or a psychologist because I'm chat and I don't have that thing I, mean, I wanted to add that filter to me but I think my editor doesn't know how to add the chat filter into my video but if he did I'll be happy to see it but for now I know he can't so sorry man I'm even blaming you in my videos because that last video you said some stuff you didn't cut that video I'm gonna fuck you up and you know that yeah I talk to my editor like that and we're still good and successful I'm sexy Am I not? Am I not? Am I, I don't want to be cleaned more, 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 more. But yeah, this, but yeah, this, this thing, thing actually, is actually, is actually, with John, with John, with John, heavy and 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 and on that off-road car you have everything because someone has to be with you and go uphill and downhill with you so that you can travel up and down you know you come down with the bike you go up with the guy with the off-road car but yeah this is what happens and you're gonna probably I mean, if I was there I will do this uh, if I was there and saw you with this bike I will say <laughs> dude how much did you pay for this piece of junk made in the garage huh and you're gonna be saying I paid about around nine thousand dollars, love. And he's like, "Oh shit! With nine thousand dollars, you could buy the best trick bike, or uh, trick downhill bike, or I don't know, specialized downhill bike, or the best one, Santa Cruz downhill bike, to have fun with it. A lot of us would even go racing, but I think you're a new ass bitch that you you're riding this yeah, piece of junk from the garage." I know when you pay for this thing, the company who made this in their garage, I can't imagine making this in a company. You know, I'm thinking about garage actually. The Juggernaut. Like in Deadpool or Dota 2. Dota 2. Juggernaut is actually better, but if you don't know what Dota 2 is, I don't care. Yeah. And the Juggernaut is famous there. You already did for not knowing that. Not me. Yeah, so the company is gonna be like, ah, we are rich. This is gonna be the suit, actually. This is not a suit, but I mean, it's gonna be a suit. We're gonna be rich. These idiots are paying $9,000 for this. I mean, I'm not sure if it's $9,000, but I think it's expensive. I mean, I heard the price before, but I don't know it now. So probably something expensive, $8,000, $9,000, $7,000. All of them make sense because it's a... It has an electric engine and it's very strong. Those wheels and all, probably a huge ass braking brake system because of those wheels and the way it has. It has lights. I mean, who the fuck actually goes mountain biking or downhill biking? It's the worst one at night. 
No one. But you will. Why? Because you are paying for this piece of garage junk. You're paying for this. You're paying $9,000 for this. And yes, you will do that. Why not? You're the idiot. I mean, when you go uphill or downhill biking with a bike, you actually have someone with a car, off-road car with you. So what, what are the lights for? You're just gonna put the fucking bike and the car and go home. You don't even need those lights. But they said, maybe they're gonna ride in the city. Are you an idiot who pays $9,000 for this junk to ride in a city? I don't think it goes fast. I mean, even if it does, it's bullshit. Don't pay for this much, I mean. Juggernaut. Pay $9,000 to get this junk be scammed as usual in America, they get scammed. I mean, the scammers in America are actually good at making some research on them and they, they're really good. They scam people really well. I mean, the people are kind of immune now. Well, yeah, they, they really do their job well. You really have to go to a shop and buy stuff if you want something. You can't get them online there. It's hard to trust everything. But yeah, it's a scam, guys. It's a fucking scam. You buy this piece of junk and the company is going to have fun with the money they have. It's probably, even the engine is probably made in the garage. The shape of that thing. Usually good stuff, good electrical bicycles have this huge ass body that uh, the, the battery is kind of inside it and the engine is mostly in the wheels or even if they're uh, behind the pedal gear or whatever the fuck, the front gear it's gonna be a better engine. I mean, it's gonna be built in the body, not like out of the body with a piece of gear connected to the pedals, the front gear. That was make mistake on that, even though I was a cyclist. It's a garage thing, and it costs nine thousand dollars. I mean, I'm not. I said it. I'm not sure about nine thousand dollars, but it's a garage junk, for God's sake. Garage junk. I'm gonna call this garage junk from now on, but weirdly. The video is ending, it's taking too long. What can I do now? I'll tell you. You can go watch the rest of the video, so. See ya! Actually, this was the move that I did before, and I told my editor to edit it and not put it in there, and I did it again. Yeah, I'm editing. Probably. The camera moved again. Oh my god.